What's up gamers? We're back with another WWE Immortals video and I am playing in the online tournament in my quest for the four star gear card and I've got a team right here and I'm just going to jump right into battle and I'll explain what I'm doing as I'm playing. But basically I'm trying to build a teams that get a good amount of renown so that I can play to win the four star gear card and I'm kind of set on beating the dual big shows. Now there was a very helpful suggestion. I just wanted to thank you, everybody that posted the comment section of my video for yesterday on the second part of this series, you know, because when I came up against that dual big show, I mean, it was very disheartening. And one of the best suggestions I saw was that maybe I should just take a legendary gold in with a silver and a bronze and just not even bother you know, going up against them, and the Renown is still decent, like the 3200 to 3600 range on the first battle. Now, this particular team right here with Roman, Trish, and John Cena, I'll explain what I'm doing here. Basically, Roman Reigns does all of my damage, and he has the Chairman Shoot, which is the five star gear card, which has him start off with one bar of adrenaline. And then it also has adrenaline drain on a, like a 10% chance or so on a finisher. So like right there was a finisher, that last swipe. And that is pretty good because sometimes he will drain their adrenaline. And he's just basically on damage mode. And I have two gear cards on him that boost his damage. One boosts the critical rate another one boosts the critical damage and right there i just completed all of today's quests very cool so that's good also all right so that's what my roman reigns is doing and that's why i have red criticals from the gear and that's why he starts off with one bar of adrenaline and that's also why sometimes he drains the opponent's adrenaline now that last battle they had actually a ton of gear cards this one here also looks like they're just a tad over 500 gear cards on this one wow that's cool and so that last battle, I think there was at least 500 also. So we're, these are hard battles. Now, Trish Stratus, I've got two health cards on there, and both of the health cards boost her health. One of them has team heal so that I can heal my Roman Reigns. And then one of the cards is a four-star card that does team damage on signature one and also boosts the team adrenaline drain for, by 100% for six seconds. So she is just my backup Hopefully she can just save my Roman Reigns when he's running low on health. And that's just kind of the point, as I'm going to use Roman Reigns to do all the damage, Trish Stratus to do the healing, and then John Cena is just there as a placeholder to basically do the heal block. Now it looks like it, when I hit the, the OK symbol up on the top left corner, it looks like that heal block is activated right now. Reduce enemy healing. You saw that flash right underneath the pause sign. Okay, so Trish is in here, and you'll see that her adrenaline is just going up automatically. 12,000 healing to my Roman Reigns, and it's doing damage to everybody on the team. Plus, she's a beast anyways. Okay, back with Roman Reigns, second special. Here we go. So this was a 500 gear card battle that we just went up against right now and I didn't have any trouble with that and that is over. What I'm hoping is that this team will be able to beat the dual big shows. Otherwise, that's just kind of my mission right now is like this mindset is just like got to beat the dual big shows because a lot of people want to see that happen because it's really annoying. All right, what do we got here? Okay, so we've got a team of 368, 200, what is that, 550, and then another, so this is about an 800 gear card battle, and looks like they're all maxed out, prestige 750s, so not an easy battle right here, you know, and if this team can take on this, and then it can take on the big shows, it's a good team, I'll use it all the time. Okay. Triple H has got lifesteal. I'm hoping that that is being reduced at least a little bit by the John Cena card. Oh, man. I wish he hadn't have blocked that. Face buster. All right. He's going down. I got to be careful with these cards doing a ton of damage. 
I think right now, oh yeah, I got to take out Brock quickly because he is healing everybody on the team. You see that? Everybody went up like by 12,000 health. Come on, take him out, take him out, take him out. Not quite. He's going to tap out. Oh, another 12,000 healing. Okay, Trish, come on in. You got to do some magic. You're going to make me heal for 12,000. Okay. Okay, one more healing, and then we'll bring in Roman. Okay, so this was an 800 gear point battle on maxed out legendaries, and you can see I'm not having trouble. Now, both my Roman and Trish Stratus are completely maxed out, and I've got about 200 gear points on Roman, maybe 220, 230, and about, I don't know, 60, 70 on Trish. I really think that these battles suddenly at some point become all about gear cards. So, you know, when I'm fighting with 600 gear cards, yeah, 223 on Roman, 84 on Trish. Ah, 4,000 renowned, which is awesome. Let's see. Bring me this dual big show nightmare. Okay, again, we're going up 350, 350. We're going up against a thousand gear points in this battle right here. That's nuts! And they're all maxed out. So we're taking on the some of the top teams right now. There's really, I don't know if you can do more than a thousand gear cards. Oh my god, dude. Here they go. Oh, and he must have the chairman suit. He started off with two bars, which is nuts. I do not want to get hit. This would be awesome if he dies right here because that eliminates a lot of that silliness with healing. Okay, 1K. Oh. Okay, this is going well. Oh, and Brock Lesnar's got the healing. He's able to heal uh, Dean Ambrose by 20,000 on every first signature. That would be awesome if the adrenaline steal went, happened right now. Did not. Ah, ground and pound. But you're dead, buddy. Now, I don't know what to do here. I know I need to use a signature move to knock out Dean Ambrose. I think I want to soften him a little bit. And then tap in my Trish. Okay, now it's time for Trish to come in. And I think I'm just going to ping him. Oh, don't do that. I'm going to ping him until his... Um, lunatic mode or whatever it's called where you basically he's immune to basic damage all right we're getting close furious smackdown all right as soon as that triggers i will probably go into a second special ah don't hit me all right i need to do first specials here just to heal up my roman reigns and i'll bring in roman reigns to finish the job all right, now his Lunatic Rage has triggered, so first special for the win. And we're taking out a thousand gear, fully prestige seven hacker team. <laughs> Actually, I don't know if that guy's a hacker. I shouldn't call people hackers. I really don't care if people hack this game. It doesn't affect me. I still want to beat them. And it's more of a challenge to take on these teams anyways. Oh my God, here it is. Okay. Now, this is not the suicide team because it does not have a crap load of gear. But this team right here, even with it's just the dual big shows maxed out, is not an easy battle, even by itself. And it looks like I went into the top 4%. Okay, so this is the first real test to see if this team actually works and can beat the dual BS team. That's what I'm calling it, dual BS. I think it's, the other thing that I want to say is that based on the suggestions in the comment section and any suggestions you guys have, you know, I'll listen to them, is to take out the light and big show first. And I think that's going to be my goal here. And honestly, this is not the battle that I wanted to show you guys. The battle I wanted to show you is this same exact team here with like a thousand 
gear cards. Okay, now I'm going to do... Oh, no. Nah. I don't know what to do. I think I'm going to save my third special on... Yeah, for right now. That's what I wanted to do. Save my third special for Enlightened Big Show. I don't think that's going to be enough damage to kill him. But it might be enough. We're going to bring in Trish... Okay. Let's see. I think I want to do one more round of tranquility. Come on, kill him off before he heals too much. Come on, die, die, die. I really think this John Cena thing is working. I do. Because I've seen that big show heal himself for like 3,000. And that can't be all gear cards. Some of that has to be just... You know, hit points, you know. I feel pretty good about this video right here. It looks like I'm taking him down with no troubles whatsoever. So we're going to just let Roman clean up. Roman has full health right now. And hopefully on my uh, battle tomorrow, I will have more information on you, whether this team can actually take out a fully geared out dual BS team. And also, I'm going to start exploring the idea of taking in a really good gold card with a really good silver and really good bronze to see if I can actually beat these teams that are similar to this. I mean, they're not going to be as outrageous, you know, 1,000 gear cards. But if, you know, I can still get 3,200, 3,600 Renown in those battles, I'll be happy with that. So there you got it. I was successful in beating that team. It looks like that John Cena card is working great. And... Any suggestions whatsoever, put it down in the comment section below. I love hearing from you guys. So, as always, thanks for watching and keep on gaming.